It all goes back to a time before you came here when Adam first found Cringer in the hills of Eternia. I had just made a new device and Adam had offered to test it. Here's the new animal caller I made up, Adam. It imitates all the sounds of the animals you're likely to see on your camping trip. Oh, thanks, man-at-arms. I'll see you in a few days. Mid-morning, spotted one spine deer, a young buck, general area of forest glade. Well, that call works. Uh-oh, saber cat. And he looks hungry. The only thing a saber cat is afraid of is a mandacore. Maybe I can scare it off with a mandacore call. Whew, thank goodness this works. Look at you, fella. Where's your mother? You've been hurt. Let's see what we can do to fix you up. That might make you feel better, but you don't look too good, fella. I think I better take you back to where you can be properly treated. He's very badly hurt, Adam. I don't know if I can save him. Well, you have to try. He lost his mother somehow. He got terribly hurt out there alone. If I hadn't come a long way... Don't worry, Adam. I'll do my best. It took quite a while, but with my help and Adam's love and care, the kit gradually got well. Hey, I think you'll be all right. <laughs> I think so, too. Mostly thanks to you. Cat. Look at him shake. <laughs> Boo! Let him alone. He's not even a real pet, Adam. He's just a cringer. Cringer, cringer, cringer. I don't care. I like him. <laughs> cringer, cringer, cringer. It's all right. You're a great pet. <laughs> But I must admit, Cringer is a good name for you. You're afraid of your own shadow. Oh, hello, Sorceress. Hello, Adam. Hello, Cringer. Cringer, stop trembling. The Sorceress is our friend. Adam, do not be impatient with your pet. Well, he embarrasses me sometimes. In spite of that, you will find he will be very important to you in the future. You may call him Gringer, but he is not entirely what he seems to you just now. I don't understand. You will. 